It's in here somewhere. Oh. Ta-da! Oh, hi friends. I'm Manny, and this is my magnificent magnifying glass. Do you want to know what a magnifying glass does? Yup. It makes small things look bigger. I just found something super tiny outside, and I need to make it look bigger. Do you know what's in here? Yes, there are ants. I found ants. Let's see how many I have. One, two, three. I have three ants. My teacher's helping me learn all about ants. She said that they have one, two, three body parts, and that they have one, two, three, four, five, six legs. Hmm. I wonder what ants eat. Who? Who? Hey, it's Ollie. Hello, Manny. Who? Who? Collecting tiny bugs, are you? I found some ants, and I'm learning all about them. I'm glad you like learning. I do too. I know the best teacher for me and for you. Let's listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Welcome to Look and See, the place where we look and we look and we see what's in the Bible. Are you ready to look inside the mystery box and see what we can learn from the Bible today? If you're ready, on the count of three, yell, take a look. Ready? One, two, three. Take a look. Whoa! It's a house. <gasps> and it's another house. And even more. This is so cool. I know. This is for the story Jesus told to teach us the best way to live. Let's have some fun. his son Jesus to be our friend forever. One of the ways Jesus is a good friend is that he teaches us the best way to live. We can find what Jesus teaches us right here in the Bible. This story Jesus told is about two men who both built a house. One man built his house on a strong rock. Can you make a rock like this? <laughs> awesome, look at how strong that is. The other man built his house on sand. Can you show me sand like this? Great job! Sand likes to move around a lot and it's not very strong. So we have one house on rock, show me rock. Good, and we have one house on sand. Show me sand. Awesome! Now, what do you think will happen when it rains? Let's take a look. Look at the house on the rock. Is it moving? Nope, it's nice and safe because it was built on the strong rock. Now, let's see what happens to the house on the sand. strong enough to hold it up. So, which man made the wise choice? The best choice? The man who built his house on the sand? Or the man that built his house on the rock? That's right, the rock. Jesus told us this story because he wants everyone to know how important it is to make wise choices. When we make wise choices, we are like the man who built his house on the rock. We can stand strong. 
So how do we stand strong? We look in the Bible and see what Jesus teaches us about the best way to live. There's so much more that we can learn from Jesus and it's all right here in the Bible. So take a look. You can look in the Bible at church, at home, or right here on Look and See. I'm so glad God gave us Jesus to teach us and to be our friend forever. Oh, hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. See you tomorrow for another Look and See. Bye! <laughs> so there's your story, and it's all true. Jesus teaches us how to live and makes us strong, too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Hoo, hoo. Wow, when we look in the Bible, Jesus teaches us the best way to live. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did say got it, get it? Got it! Good! I love learning about bugs, but I can learn even more from Jesus. I'm gonna take a look at my Bible and see what else Jesus teaches us. I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Nothing.